Hello Tokusatsu community and welcome back to Toku Topics. Today we're going to be taking a look at the next two and as of right now final two rider gears or sentai gears from the Zenkaiger toy line. So last month we took a look at the zero or was it last month? I think it was last month. We took a look at the zero one sentai gear which came with the issue of Telegukun and everything like that. And, uh, well, there's two more rider gears that they were going to make, and, well, they're here today. So, let's go ahead and open this up here. This should have an issue of Telebukun inside as well. So, a different kind of box than I've had from Two Collectibles before. Uh, you know, it's kind of like a, you know, I had a little flap to it and everything, so that's interesting. So, the rubber band that's on this thing has, like, completely bent the hell out of this magazine, uh, which is unfortunate, but that's just kind of what it did. Uh, but yeah, you get one of those big rubber bands. So there's that. Oh no, you get two. You get two rubber bands. So fancy. Anyway, here is the December or no, January. Yeah, January issue of Telebukun. Magazines are strange <laughs> in terms of how they work. Uh, but this is the one that obviously comes with the Geo and Saber Sentai gears. So yep, this will go pretty nice with the Zero One gear. Uh, this magazine here is basically the one that we got all of those skins for the Barred Rex uh, form for Revice. So it's going to pretty much have the skins from that. So like we have Comrade Genie. Uh, looks like you get some kind of little thing there. Uh, let's see. So yeah, this is going to have you know, details on Barred Rex, which is uh, just debuted in the show uh, in the most recent episode, which Revice is very good. I love this show. I uh, can't wait to get more Revice toys. Like, there's some more pictures of Barlid Rex and Vice and everything. Like, uh, his Vice just gets a shield in this form. So there's that. Uh, there's, like, a rider kick of Barlid Rex and stuff like that. Uh, we get... Uh, this is going to happen pretty soon. Live getting the Jackal form uh, using the Jackal stamp, uh, just like Evil did. So that's going to be neat to see that. We have our brand new Kamen Rider, Kamen Rider Genie. So there's Sakura down there. Love the suit, and there's Love Co., being cute and such like that. Uh, we got more genie. We got uh, the, that really big picture of Love Go. This is the one that has the uh, you know the cannon, the turtle cannon with the V3 stamp. And uh, we just saw this one, the Peacock Fan, uh, which is Z Cross's stamp. So some more Showa Riders and such. Oh yeah, we had this this little teaser for the Hyper Battle DVD of uh, Revice, which looks to be some kind of kangaroo form or something. Uh, people are speculating maybe that's the Zero One stamp or the Build stamp or something. Oh yeah, and then we get these pictures of the Beyond Generations film that's coming out next week. Uh, be sure to check out my video talking about all the details on Beyond Generations. I uploaded it the other day uh, talking about like these photos down here of returning evil riders and group shots of you know the good riders and stuff. Uh, we get the Bard Rex toy uh, pictures. Uh, we get uh, some Soto figure pictures of them doing the remix forms. Uh, the best that they can. And of course, some Gond Rising cards. Uh, but when we get to the Zenkaidra stuff, it's very generic stuff. You get this really nice shot of Kaito without a helmet, so that's cool. And you get to Kaiser versus Zenkaiser, although Kaiser is going to get a cape now this month, so that's fun. I'm it's like three months behind, four months behind on Zenkaiser, so I need to get caught up. Uh, but we have Kaiser's new mecha he's going to get, so that's pretty neat. And uh, just some more stuff, and then we get into like Pokemon and manga and Ultraman. And on the back, we have an ad for the Revice Driver and an ad for the Bard Rex Vi Stamp, and then like the main 10. So, moving on from that, we have this, which is obviously the whole reason why I bought this. And this is the magazine pack in Kamen Rider Saber and Kamen Rider Geo Sentai Gears. So, these will go nice with the Zero One gear, which all were used in that one episode of Zenkaiger. And uh, this is the first time we've ever had two gears in one magazine pack-in. Uh, I don't really ever do that. I can't really think of a time we've gotten, like, two of a gimmick item in a magazine pack-in. Uh, I would have I kind of been surprised that it's not just spread across three magazines. Oh, yeah! You get a Gumbarite card, or a Gumbarizing card as well. I completely forgot that that was included. Ooh, look how sparkly it is. So you get this really pretty uh, Gumbarizing card of Barred Rex Revi. And on the back... We have Revi there again. So, yeah, Barred Rex Genome. That's pretty nice. I'll just kind of put that back there. And then in here we have the two gears. So, same kind of you know, packaging we usually get with these kind of packing gears and such. And there they are. So, we have the Geo gear and the Saber gear. 
Oh, which looks a lot like a Christmas gear or something. But it's not the Christmas gear. We have that coming out later on, uh, I think this month, with the Christmas cake, which I did pre-order that. Not the cake. I don't get the cake. I just get the gear <laughs> from the collectibles. So let's get this out of here so we can test them out in the gear cleaner. And uh, let's clean this up a little bit. All right, so here's the Geo and Saber Rider gears out of the package here. And they look very nice. I, I'm really happy with these gears. I'll take a look at Geo's first. You get the nice gray and kind of metallic a chrome pink there, which I think looks really nice. And you get the 20, because this is the 20th Heisei Rider. And you get that translucent sparkly green. On the back, you get Geo's logo, and it is gonna be gear number 63. Uh, so this one will be the same one as the Zero One gear. It will use the generic Kamen Rider sound, because uh, there is no program sound in there for Geo or Zero One specifically, but that works. So we got Geo, but this one is gonna be a new one here. This is the Commodore Saber gear, so very Christmasly, because uh, you have like that red background with the chrome. You get Zero Two, because this is the second Reiwa era series. But you get Saber there, which looks very similar to how he did on the Two Die Hero gear, which had Zenkaiser and Saber for superhero time. So there's that. On the back, you get Saber's logo, and this is going to be gear number 60. Let me try to catch the light on it. 61. Uh, because this one actually will say Kamen Rider Saber in the gear cleaner. So uh, let's go ahead and bring in the gear cleaner and take a look. All right, so let's bring in Geo's gear first. And roll the name. And the attack sound. So yep, the same exact thing as we saw with the Zero One gear, if you watched my video on that last month, which will be kind of probably popping up here or linked in the end card. Now we got Saber, who is going to be a unique one. Roll the team name. In the attack set. So, I mean, virtually it is the same as the regular Comrade gear. It just obviously says Saber afterward. Oh, and the Rekabato instead of the Henshin, which is a cool thing. Uh, so, yeah, that's going to basically do it, though. Uh, so, let's go ahead and bring Zero One in so we can just you know see all three of them on screen. All right, and there it is with the Zero One gear that we got in last month's Kelly Bakun issue. And these look fantastic together. I think Zero One probably pops the most. I think it definitely looks the nicest with that red on the neon yellow or the neon green or whatever. Uh, but yeah, here we go. These are the ones that were used on screen by the actual Zenkaisers. Uh, Gawon, Zenkaiser, and Juron used these three. And so, yeah, I like that, we, that they actually made them. I'm, I'm happy that they weren't like locked in a premium set or something. And they just were available as part of like a Telebukun pack-in. I think that ended up working out pretty well. And I highly recommend them, even though they basically all sort of do the same thing. Uh, but hey, you know, I would not be opposed if we got more Sentai gear uh, for riders. Uh, especially with gears continuing for another year. It would not be surprising to me if we got some kind of reviving vice gear or something or something like that but uh taking away zero one here because these were the ones that actually just came with this magazine issue and the barred rex uh gomb rising card which if we can maybe make these stand that up or we could do this look at that ingenuity right there so <laughs> that's gonna do it uh for these brand new sentai gear rider gears uh, the, we're pretty much winding down here on the, uh, you know, Sentai Gear toy line for, for regular Sentai Gears from Zenkaiger. Uh, we pretty much just have the Christmas gear left, which will be coming out this month, and all of Stacy's evil stuff, uh, for next month. And that's basically it, unless they announce more stuff like hopefully a Kiba Ranger someday. But thank you all for watching, and until next time, you can check out all my other Sentai Gear videos on the channel. I've literally reviewed the entire Sentai Gear toy line, I've bought every single one of them. And uh, yeah, that's all I got. Until next time, you can follow me on Twitter at LivingRangerKey or LightningFigPR. And I'll see you all next time. Zenroku Zenkai.